Okay. Uh, well, I'm just getting my day here started here. Christmas Day here in Las Vegas. Um, figured I'd shoot a little video. Uh, tell you how things been going out here. Um, it's pretty cool. It's my first time here. Never been here before. Um, I've just been doing a whole lot of wandering around. Uh, just looking. Uh, of course, taking pictures, blowing up everybody's Instagram and all that other stuff. Um, just storing the memories. Um, not a whole lot else been going on. Um, I haven't done much gambling. I, I might have gambled. I did a couple of the, the little slot machines or whatever. I came out on top. I bet went in with nine dollars, left for fifteen, and you know I did that a couple of times. But I'm not big on gambling, so I ain't do too much of that. Um, one thing I noticed since I've gotten here, I don't know if it's because it's the Christmas holiday or what, but. Um, there's a lot of Asian people out here. Um, white folks are in the minority. Um, Hispanic folks in the minority. Black folks is, I, it is, I can't say it's none, but it's almost rare. You, out of a hundred people, you might see one black person. It is strictly, um, Indian, Asian, and Middle Eastern out here right now. And this that's not even a joke. This, I've been up and down the strip from uh, Mandalay and Luxor all the way down to Fremont. But I didn't really get to see Fremont, but at least down to where a certain circus is. The whole strip is it's foreign. It's foreign. And there's nothing wrong with that. It's just an observation. But I almost wondered if I got off, uh, got on the wrong plane, got on the wrong flight. And once I started walking around, I don't see nothing but Chinese people. There's a bunch of them out here. Um, you know, I'm a foot taller than everybody, so you know how that go. Um, but that's cool, you know. Um, I got to go inside a bunch of the casinos, uh, take a look around see what's going on. I hadn't caught any shows or anything like that. That's still on the itinerary. I wanted to get a bit of looking around first before I did that and make sure I'm not blowing my budget because I am definitely not on a baller's budget here. Um, I'm trying to make sure I can do everything and not blow blow my wad and go home broke. Uh, so I'm doing all of that. Uh, I'm going to have to uh, check out some of the restaurants out here. I haven't really done a whole lot of that. I've been um, I've been snacking mostly. I ain't want to really eat too much while I'm out and about for various reasons. Um, I had not really drank a whole lot since I've been out here. I might I might indulge. There's plenty of liquor stores around here. I tell you that for goddamn sure. There's liquor everywhere. But I hadn't drunk anything. I've been moving around. I didn't want to be uh, out of my mind too much. Uh, moving around out here, for me. Um, right now, I'm in uh, Bill's Gambling Hall, which is right across the street from. Uh, well, it's almost it's right next to the Flamingo, right across the street from the Bellagio, directly across the street from Caesar's Palace, and directly across the street from uh, Bally's. So it's right in the middle of everything. You really, uh, the rooms are okay. It's small. There's no fridge or microwave in here, but you're not supposed to be up in the room out there anyway. But it's, it's pretty cool. It was cheap. It was on like $35, $40 a night anyway. So I'm right in the middle of everything. Um, I get to move around and see a whole bunch of stuff. And, um, that's about it. You know, I got my shades on. I'm still, I still have my morning face on. I'm, I'm about to uh, get ready to, I'm ironing right now. Uh, iron my clothes so I can get ready to hit the streets again. And 
do some more looking around. I think I'm gonna hit up Hooters, uh, Luxor, Mandalay Bay, New York, New York. I'm gonna work that side of the strip today and uh, do some some sightseeing. Probably uh, play a couple of slides in each one and um, try to enjoy that. Um, I mean, here until Thursday. Uh, Thursday I move to Circus Circus. Uh, I'm gonna be in there for about four days. Uh, once I leave out of here till New Year's, and I'll work that end of the trip once I get down there. It's it's a lot. My feet, my feet aren't really bothering me, but after the first couple of days, when I woke up this morning, my calves were burning like crazy. Um, you know, they got all these little detours and stuff they run you through, and most of them uh, require you to go up an escalator upstairs. And uh, the escalators don't always work, so you end up on the stairs quite a bit. Um, so I'm not really worried about that. I need that little bit of workout anyway. So um, I'm enjoying myself. Uh, decided to get y'all up with a video. Merry Christmas to everybody. Uh, happy holidays and all of that, blah, blah. Uh, hope everybody back home. I know it's wet out there. I've I seen that it started raining. I knew that shit was coming. But it's been pretty cold out here. It ain't like super freezing cold, but it's uh, the highs are in the 50s. Uh, it's not like back in, in Houston where you got 60s, 70s, and then at night it's in the 30s and all of that other stuff. It's pretty chilly all day. It's in the 50s and then it get down into the 30s, which ain't bad. You know, 37, 38, something like that. It's not bad. It's not that cold unless the wind is blowing. Now, if the wind is blowing, it's time to take your ass indoors. Cause, uh, uh, a lot of people out here, <laughs> um, they they dressing like Houston folks when it gets 60. They got these big ass winter coats on with fur and all kind of shit. And kind of wish I had one, but you know, the little another jacket I got is good enough. And, you know, the cold don't bother me that much. So. Um, I'm not going to let that bother me, but I still got some stuff to do. I still got my souvenirs to get. Um, I'm not going to do that um, until I move into my other room at Circus Circus, and then I'm going to do my souvenir shopping because I don't know exactly what I'm going to get for the people I'm going to get them for and all that other stuff. I'm going to have to write down a list because I think I pretty much forgot the names. So I'm going to have to write down a list, and I, wanna, I don't want to tear nothing up packing and repacking, so I'm just going to... Uh, do that after I move, and then I don't have to worry about repacking and unpacking all that stuff again. So, um, I hit you with an update. I probably do another uh, video uh, if something interesting happens or I have some other observations. Uh, but that's it. I'm about to finish out in my clothes, watch some more of this damn Christmas story marathon while I'm doing that. Uh, hit the streets, and I will see you guys later. Peace.